Welcome to this edition of Safety First. I'm your host, Tim Kelly, joined today by Captain Kevin Harrison with the Suffolk Police Department to talk about a very unique event that they have coming up in just a little bit of time. It's an open house, so a great opportunity for the public to find out a lot more about what's going on with the police department and some of the behind the scene looks as far as some of the tools and techniques and things that they have going on. Captain, thanks for being with us today. Absolutely. So we talk about the open house. What is the thinking behind having this type of event? I know you had it before, but mm -hmm. talk about really what the focus is for this year that y'all were trying to do. It, it's twofold. Mm -hmm. um, we look at it as a recruitment tool. So people interested in becoming a police officer can come and speak to, we'll, we'll have recruiters on hand, um, speak to recruiters, um, find out the process. And while they're doing that, they can also see firsthand what we have at the police department as okay. far as different divisions, Correct. different equipment, things of that nature. Because I mean, the police department, just like a lot of public safety agencies, are a lot more than what people necessarily see all the time. Yes. You know, again, there, there's a lot of equipment and things that back up the men and women who do the work. But I think that's one of the things that'll be interesting about the open house is that you're going to have some of those tools on display and people can get really get a feel for some. I didn't know you did that. I'm sure you're going to hear that a lot that particular day. And that's a good thing to know as far as what, again, the men and women of the department are doing out there, um, you know, keeping our community safe and being able to react given a situation occurring again with public safety being the forefront of that. Correct? Mm -hmm. Yes. Um, as I said, it's twofold because mm -hmm. it's a cr recruitment tool as well as we would invite the community Correct. to come. Um, anybody who's interested in what we do, anybody who wants to take a look at tools that we use, um, we're going to have people on hand from each division, so you right. talk to each division, find okay. out what they do, and maybe you don't know you're interested in being a police officer. Correct. And you may come out there and go, wow. Will there be ran, uh, rotating presentations or would literally be things that are on display and the people are there to interact with anybody comes, answer questions, let people kind of get a it'll, feel It'll things? be something where everybody will come in through a, a, a central location, sure. come into a central room, there'll be a presentation for okay. everybody to hear, mm -hmm. and then they'll be guided around after that, and, and that will be on a rotating basis. So it's not like everybody has to be in at the same time. Got it. Um, yeah. It might be every half hour, every hour, mm -hmm. something. To, so anybody can come whenever okay. they're whenever they're able to. It doesn't have to be at a certain time. So we've talked about the event as far as in a, in a basic sense, but where's it going to be? When's it going to be? And what's the time frame on that day? It'll be at Precinct Two okay. at thirty nine oh three Bridge Road. It'll be on September twenty first, right. and it'll begin at ten a.m. and it'll go till three p.m. Okay, around that time. All right, so plenty, a, a lot of a good opportunity over the course of that particular day yes. to come out. You said it's Precinct 2, so we're talking up, up northern part of Suffolk. Um, parking, I believe, correct me if I'm wrong, not directly on Bridge Road, but there's plenty of parking in the back lot over there yes, between we'll the fire station sure and the police department. Parking, yes. So good. So again, people can kind of come and go as they want to right over there. Um, just enter. I'm sure there'll be good signage and directing yes. people in as far as to enter the building and kind of go through. You said the presentation and then obviously having some of the equipment um, out in, in the back area over there on display. No, it'll actually be in the front. It'll be in the front. Okay, yes. very good, very good. So you have everything organized over there. Um, I know you have done it before. Um, usually get a pretty good, really good turnout. And again, like you said, it's a unique opportunity because it's not just a chance. I know we're kind of coming off National Night Out, great opportunity to interact with the public, get out there. Um, but this is another opportunity to interact with the public. But as you also mentioned, uh, and it's a very key point, you're using it as a recruiting tool. Yes. So people you know, are thinking about a career in law enforcement, um, hopefully thinking about a career in law enforcement here in Suffolk, of course, yes. uh, but have questions about the department. Because I'm sure, yeah, law enforcement, there, there are definitely some common threads, but every department has its own nuances to it. Yes. Uh, every community is a little bit different as far as between our, our, our neighbors and uh, beyond. But, um, you know, this is a good chance for, again, y'all to talk with people. I mean, there's information, good information on your website talking about recruitment and how people can, can try to apply to become an officer. But to really talk about it with people who are doing that job, finding out what it's about, and, and kind of, I use the phrase loosely, press the flesh, so to speak, because you're right there dealing with them directly. It's a perfect opportunity for y'all to market yourselves, right? Yes, absolutely. And like I said, we're going to have representatives from every division. Um, so that anybody who has any questions can come and ask us, mm -hmm. and we'll be happy to talk. And, and I'm sorry. I, I, I really hope it is a community engagement opportunity as much as it is a recruiting effort. Correct. And I know the term of the event is open house, but you, correct me if I'm wrong, there's no registration. You, no, really, people literally can come up day of, and you're gonna be, all are gonna be welcome and, and yes. welcome on in. I'm assuming rain or shine. Yes. All right, right, correct, because again, a lot of it would be inside. Um, Unless it's, well, 
with, with you know, yeah. like really bad, then, then we might have to, and we do have a backup date Sure, in I mind. got you, I got you. And of course, we'll get that information out in the event that it would be, we'll publicize it on social media and the like in the event that that would come up. But as we know, what I always, always, like, always like to say, it's always sun shining here in San Antonio, <laughs> Suffolk. So that won't occur, we won't have to use that option. But um, again, recapping again, it's Saturday, September 21st. Yes. At Precinct 2, which is on 3903 Bridge Road. Bridge Road, yes. Okay. And again, the time frame is from 10 a.m. until 3. About 3, okay, very good. So again, um, you know, it's open to anybody, whether you're a Suffolk resident or not. Um, again, considering a career in law enforcement or not. Um, but again, a great chance to get to know a little bit more about your Suffolk Police Department. Um, talk with some of the men and the women from the different divisions and how the department is broken Absolutely. up right there as yes. far as what the different areas of focus there. Um, what are some of the things, I should say, that are going to be on display or, or part of the presentation that people might not know the police department handles that you might want to kind of highlight just a little bit here? Don't want to give away everything, but just a if, if few little things. We'll have, uh, most people know we have a SWAT team. Correct. They'll be out there. Um, we do have a boat unit. They'll mm -hmm. be out there. Um, we have an underwater search and recovery unit. They'll be out there. Um, we have a, a drone unit. They'll be out there. We have a search and rescue. And they'll be out there with their equipment. And we'll have other areas set up with uh, Detective Bureau, Special Operations, um, maybe Neighborhood Enforcement Team, mm -hmm. um, school resource officers, and, uh, and of course our recruiting people. Right. And again, you know, this is all the ways that the, again, the men and women of the Suffolk Police Department are keeping everybody safe and secure as far as in our city um, with the different areas and divisions. And again, everybody, and some people I know double up and might serve on different teams or yes. depending upon circumstances would be, but it's a good chance to get a feel for some of the opportunities that exist within the department. Um, you know, certainly, you know, street patrol, everybody would focus, think about that. But again, there's so many different other facets yes. that filter into that that make this a cohesive team, it a all unit. Work. Exactly. I mean, it, it doesn't flow together. And then certainly the need um, with all the water access, you talk about the marine units um, that exist and, and the role that they play here. Um, you know, I mean, you, you have so many different things that we don't always see. And sometimes we see them at the, at, the, at the worst time when situations are going on. But knowing they're there, knowing the men and women are trained, they have the proper equipment, they ha again have the training to back that up, mm -hmm. I think always makes us feel a little more secure when we start thinking about public safety here in the city of South. Absolutely. Well, Captain, I appreciate your time today. And again, want to, just before we close, I want to give you one sales pitch, final opportunity to talk to anybody watching this segment that would get them to come out there for the open house on the 21st of September. We would really like everybody to come out, anybody who's interested. Maybe you don't know you're interested in being a police officer. Maybe you're just interested in coming out and seeing how we work and what we do and what we have. I would invite anybody who's interested to come out. Okay. Well, it Captain. should be a great, um, a great day. Yes, indeed, indeed. A great opportunity to get to know a little more about your Suffolk Police Department. And if and you want your, uh, bring bring your kids as well. Yes. We, we definitely invite kids. Right. Well, again, you know, getting to know some of the men and women of the department as well as thinking about careers long term, um, I think that's a great opportunity for y'all, again, to to interact with them and just get to know your community as well as the community get to know you. Getting yes, to know sir. you. Yes, Absolutely. Very good. Well, Captain, thanks for your time today. Anytime. Thank you. Suffolk Police Department open house Saturday, September 21st at the 2nd sec Precinct up on Bridge Road. A great opportunity to get, as I said, keep saying it, but I want to reinforce it, to get to know your Suffolk Police Department. That will do it for this edition of Safety First. I'm your host, Tim Kelly. We'll see you next time.